fun. Has it been this long? Will I ever feel your presence again? God and why am I playing this? Because uh, I, I don't know. This music sounds pretty rad, I guess. Since it's the festive season and I've spent most of the year in a perpetual state of gloom over the current state of the video game industry, I think it's time I at least try and find something to play to put a smile on my face. Now I'm told this game is pretty f, 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 f very interesting, so I don't see a problem in taking a look at it. That's what I expected from you. In Gun Hand, you play as G. Uh, huh. You have the God Hand, which lets you. Uh. Uh. uh what, what was I talking about? Oh, uh, yeah, uh, God Hand is a 3D beat-em-up that has you using outlandish powers to make your way across a quirky and over-the-top Wild West environment. If you've ever watched any of those drawn-out animes where the heroes spend their time trying to take down a list of extravagant bad guys who want dominance over the world, you basically know the plot to God Hand. However, God Hand is automatically better than any of that stuff because it's you who has to man up to the challenge of taking down these fearsome foes. Just my time! I'm not that kind of guy! Oh, really, now? Come on, those guys are cake. Not to mention, much sexier than you. God Hand's not an easy game. Is that because of the wonky borderline tank controls and the uncontrollable camera that has no idea where to angle itself? Well, yeah, uh, uh. Well, yeah, but it's also a challenge just because it actually tries to balance itself with enemies that actually require knowledge of the combat system to beat. Games like God Hand aren't hard. We've just been conditioned by years of games that do nothing but tip the odds in our favor. In regards to the combat system, I was legitimately shocked by the amount of customization it offers. You're able to map any command to any button, which is a lot more liberty than most action games give you. Of course, this does make it possible to completely break the game for yourself by stringing together a completely useless combo. Now, if you haven't noticed, the special moves in God Hand should bring a smile to even the most bitter player's face, and while mechanically there may not be anything too special, the game does have other tricks up its sleeve to keep you entertained. The more you battle without taking damage, the more you level up, making the enemies stronger. Get hit too much, though, and you'll level back down. Think of it like Cave Story, but as a beat-em-up. Huh, L1 and R1 appear to do something on the pause screen here. Ah, I see. Right. IGN, a 3.0? Seriously? They're still sexier than you are. It was while I was playing God Hand and experiencing the high-octane battles and pulse-pounding style that I started to enjoy myself in a way not too dissimilar to Devil May Cry. God Hand has some real heart to it, and though it may be a mess, partaking in its over-the-top shenanigans was actually really enjoyable. Yeah, I guess you could say God Hand is fu- Ah, screw this. Happy Holidays!